Group Light is a digital, evidence-informed tool that codifies the skill sets of interpersonal effectiveness and multifaceted human communication so that these essential life skills can easily be interpreted. Based on the theories devised by Eric Byrne and Susanna Temple, the user is asked to consider four elements of their interactions with others. The first task is a self-reflection. Users identify from a list words that they can associate themselves in their entirety, so both at home and school, with saying. However, as so much of what we say isn't just about the words we use, users also identify their tone, their gestures and their attitudes. This process is repeated with others, where peers or colleagues complete the tool with the user in mind. The completion of these tasks on the Group Light platform takes a matter of minutes. What is produced is a digitised bar chart figure that provides a framework for understanding and adapting their own behaviours, so that support, challenge, playfulness and manners can be enacted and reflected upon in thoughtful and positive ways. The, the ego ground that surprised me the most was the adult one because it was my highest. My free ch child bar because it, it is my lowest bar and I'm, I think I'm in, in my opinion, I'm in free child a lot of the time. For colleagues, completion of group lights has generated really powerful questions such as does my self-evaluation match the peer evaluation from colleagues or learners? What is congruent? What isn't? Why might this be? What are my next steps as a leader? What I was quite surprised at is that my minute when I say no wasn't as high in other survey as it was in my self survey. So that made me reflect upon perhaps there hasn't been situations that has, I've not been able to challenge um, and mean it when I say no truly. Um, so that just makes me think perhaps maybe I need to be a bit more assertive in my leadership style. Whilst it may appear reductionist, the simplicity of Group Light has been key to its success and positive impact. For learners, these insights fill the gaps they need in self-awareness to allow them to regulate their emotions more effectively, leading to better self-management, engagement in the classroom and healthier relationships with all stakeholders. The introduction of this tool has also positively correlated with self-regulated behaviour both within and outside of the classroom. So in primary, I used to get frustrated easily and talk a lot and be like destructive. And it wasn't a good like representation of me. But since I've learned transactional analysis, I've been uh, more aware of if I'm using negative or negative free child or negative adaptive child. Um, and I can realize that I'm bringing like myself back to adult. I find it easy to communicate, communicate with my parents about transactional analysis because they said that it's an easier way to um, say that you're being calm and focused at the same time. For staff within schools, Group Light has absolutely fostered better communication, collaboration and conflict resolution. Leaders who use the tool report that the increased self-awareness has built trust within their teams, enabling team members to communicate more authentically, adapting their communication to meet the needs of all of their colleagues. It's been a useful tool as well. It's allowed me to compare the differences between how I think I show up as a leader and how other people in my faculty think I show up as a leader. And that's really helped me to pinpoint my areas for development, which I've discussed with my leadership coach, which has, again, been a really helpful tool to do. As nothing will make us happier or sadder than the quality of our relationships with others, Group Light can have a very positive impact on wellbeing. It's accessible enough to be enacted in any team or classroom and comes with delivery and coaching support. Therefore, Group Light will enhance effectiveness in a range of settings. Please get in touch to find out what Group Light can do for you.